This next one comes to us from Sim Kalpin. When I was about 17, I woke in the middle of the night thirsty, and I went into the kitchen to get some water. When I walked into the kitchen and flipped on the light, I saw what I can only describe as a large golem-looking creature. It looked me in the face and then screeched a noise I will never forget and crawled on the walls into the unlit part of the house. Well, I wasn't sleeping or dreaming. I ran into my room and turned on my music and did not sleep the rest of the night. I've only told a handful of people about this, and yes, I am completely serious. That's weird. What I'm, What's not weird about it is his reaction. Being like, hmm. Just I'm going to put on music and pretend this didn't happen, which is what we all do. Yeah. And eventually they make horror movies to make fun of our stupidity. Look, man, that was my go-to move a lot was like, if, if I saw something in the middle of the night, I wasn't just going to go right back to sleep. I was going to be like, Oh great. That's creepy thing. All right. Sweet dreams. You know, I'd always turn on a TV. That was my, my go-to was, was TV or like put on a comedy album. Um, and just kind of like pretend it didn't exist. Yeah. I would put on a TV when I was younger, but now I'm like, like that time when I was at that haunted hotel in Texas and I just turned my back to it like, Oh, well, I got to get up early. True. It's funny how, you know, that happens. And even, um, kind of related, but not related when you hear like from serial killers, oh yeah, so-and-so was scared, but they just pretended they weren't and yeah, look where it got them. Really strange that it was like a golem looking thing. Like what? Okay. Why? You know, there's just a weird golem looking creature in your house when you wake up in the middle of the night, like you're trying to get water and it's just like. Do you think, you know, do you ever think he got Gollum and Dobby mixed up? They're kind of similar. They are kind of similar. Maybe it was a Dobby looking creature. Impish. Mm. Yeah, we covered that in the episode, didn't we? Yeah. There That's a. It's a creepy look. It's I'll a creepy say that. look. But the fact that like when he, when he saw it and he's kind of shocked and he like does this weird screech thing and like crawls up into the darkness of the house. Count me out. Yeah, I mean... It's going to be a no from me. I think once it's something starts crawling up the side of the house... Yeah. Who are you going to call? He, I'm going to call somebody to let me stay at their house. Yeah. There you go. I mean... A fuck a Ghostbuster. Let yeah. me come over. Yeah. Scott, yeah. I'm coming over. What? What's going on? Uh, I'll explain it when I get there. There you go. Yeah, if it ever does happen, you do that. You and do you get off the phone that. and you're like, your dad saw a demon. Yeah. He's coming over. Uh, as long as he doesn't bring that demon. <laughs> China's like, don't let him in. Yeah, I'll open the door and be like, mm, no thanks. <laughs> Hit me with some water. Just just a double take, yeah. yeah. Just a quick squirt gun of holy water, why not?